Over the course of this past year when we started touring a lot and stopped being just a studio band it started becoming very evident to me that everybody was interpreting the songs in their own ways and the ideas that I had had earlier were just getting stretched out in these five different directions you know and everybody was just pulling it towards themselves to make it that, that much you know of their own uh, vision and which sounded great to me and uh, the ideas were sounding really huge you know over each and every gig that we were doing so i spoke to the guys and i discussed the idea of doing a possible ep and before this it was just uh, in a lab featuring various artists but this time the whole goal was to feature in a lab as a band uh, it's been a wonderful experience for me very liberating very freeing because um, the music is so experimental so uh, you know there are no rules uh, in fact the only rule is that there are no rules uh, so that's been um, that's that's been something very comforting to know that one can just uh, you know go full tilt and not have to worry about fitting anything into a particular box so um, when i got called on board i said yes obviously because i wanted to play bonzo live <laughs> and i had a freaking blast at the show honestly uh, even though i was absolutely sick out of my balls you know i had an absolutely fantastic time and not just because the music was great but the musicians on stage were just so good at what they were doing and there was a there was clearly a lot of chemistry and a lot of fun that everyone was having which doesn't happen too often in a lot of session shows there's that instant chemistry sometimes that you just want to be a part of and that's what happened so i remember the first time that i met gorov i went to his studio and uh, uh, without any like we had like a normal chat and he just said that okay so this here's something that i made and i was like okay and suddenly things just started happening like without any you know like thinking or some kind of planning that oh you know this topic should be nice or that or whatever we just um, we just connected and the synergy that you know kind of took place between us was amazing cuz uh, i heard the music something came in my head i started writing it down and him and i started you know like correcting some things here and there and i think in around 1 hour we were done with the song back then when the first gig happened as a band of course uh we didn't we didn't know that it was uh, going to be a band band project as such we just we were still by the end of the gig we were still thinking you know is it is it just one of those session gigs is it going to culminate into something big or not um cut to about 7 months later we played uh, a gig at basement takeover and uh, i think that was that was the deciding factor when we all just said okay fine we're going ahead with this and uh, uh Yeah it it became a band like there was no looking back from there coming from a classical background it's been a definite feels for me here uh it's not just playing the flute but they are experimenting with different sounds different genres of music and incorporating new electronic sounds to my flute was quite interesting playing with different bands or artists over the years uh was quite a learning experience for me and one thing i have understood that music is a language which connects you with different people and i consider music as a medium to connect with my surroundings in an optical manner I like